Hey everyone, let's say you run a streaming platform where you charge your customers a particular amount for the standard plan which has access to a specific set of 500 movies and 1000 TV shows. If they want to watch any new movies or shows that are not included in their plan, they'll be charged for the extra shows or movies they enjoy. Using metered billing in Zoho Billing, you can charge customers based on their actual usage of your streaming platform. In this video, we will learn all about it. To enable metered billing in your organization, log into your Zoho Billing account, go to Settings and click Invoices under Preferences. Scroll down and check this option to enable metered billing. Then click Save. That's it. Metered billing is enabled in your organization. Once metered billing is enabled in your organization, you will be able to apply them to the subscriptions. An invoice for this plan will be created and sent to the customer for the first billing cycle automatically. If your customer has subscribed to any of the plans online, the metered billing will automatically be enabled for the subscription since it is enabled at the organization level. Upon subscription renewal, an invoice will be generated with the pending status under invoices. This way you can record the usage and charge your customers. Go to the invoices module and drill down the invoices with the status pending. Click edit. Click here to include the additionally used one-time add-ons. Note that recording add-ons can't be added to pending invoices since the usage varies every cycle. After adding, you can send this invoice to charge your customer. An invoice will be sent to them requesting payment for the plan and any additional used add-ons. Additionally, you can automate the process using custom functions and webhook features in Zoho Billing. With the help of Google Sheets, you can note down the additional usage data and use Google Apps scripts to fetch them and update the pending invoice using custom functions. Once the custom function executes successfully, the invoice will be updated with the additional charges. We have attached the link in the description below on how to implement metered billing through an API in detail. Thanks for watching.